welcome to another episode of The Functional Health Show. I'm your host, Sam Fury, and in today's episode, we'll dive deep into a topic that affects everyone. Inflammation. Yep, that's right. You've probably heard the word before, but what does it really mean? Well, think of inflammation as your body's superpower. When you get a cut, a cold, or even a bug bite, inflammation is your body's way of jumping into action. It's like your own personal superhero, fighting off invaders and kick-starting the healing process. But hold on, there's more to it than meets the eye. Inflammation isn't just about cuts and bruises. There are actually two types, acute and chronic. Acute inflammation is your body's rapid response to injury or infection. It's what makes your skin turn red, swell up, and feel warm when you stub your toe or get a splinter. It's like your body's way of saying, hey, something's not right here, let's fix it. On the flip side, chronic inflammation is like the silent villain. It sticks around for the long haul, causing trouble and wreaking havoc on your health. Things like untreated infections, unhealthy diets and even stress can keep the inflammation party going way longer than it should. Now, here's where things get interesting. Your immune system is the mastermind behind the whole inflammation operation. When trouble strikes, immune cells rush to the scene, releasing proteins called cytokines. These little guys are like messengers, rallying the troops and telling them to get to work. So, what causes inflammation in the first place? Well, it could be anything from infections and injuries to toxins and stress. Yep, even stress can throw your body into inflammation mode. But fear not, my friends, because there are ways to tame the inflammation beast. Eating a healthy diet, getting regular exercise and managing stress are all key players in keeping inflammation in check. And hey, if you need a little extra help, there are supplements out there like omega-3 fatty acids and turmeric that are known for their anti-inflammatory powers. So there you have it, folks. Inflammation may be a natural part of life, but armed with knowledge and a few healthy habits, you can keep it from running wild and ruining your day. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of The Functional Health Show. If you found this episode useful, let me know with a like, follow and share. Finally, if you haven't already, be sure to visit functionalhealthshow.com where you will find a ton of free information for improving your health as well as a step-by-step -step roadmap to help you adopt one small healthy habit at a time.